This video is presented in WesVision. 10 years ago the Pentium 4 HT was released. Is it useless in 2015? The test subject is a Dell Dimension 3100. The machine has a 2.8GHz P4 HT. It runs Windows XP Service Pack 3 and has a dedicated Sound Blaster Live sound card, along with a gigabyte of RAM and a 500GB hard disk. In terms of graphics, the machine uses the Intel Integrated Graphics Core, which has 128 megabytes of VRAM to play with. So let's see how a 10-year-old chip deals with today's computer. YouTube videos play smoothly and the sound remains intact as long as you keep them below 1080p, meaning I can get my daily hit of Rebecca Black uninterrupted by hardware lag. Attempting to play a video in 1080p will give you slowdown and dropped frames. I, all out. I kind of took a unique approach to this video. I'm going to tell you the frames per second average that I was getting here in Battlefield. Other sites such as The Verge loaded well but ran noticeably slower than usual. Simpler internet tasks such as checking email and social networking are slower but still usable. Like gaming is smooth and games like Counter-Strike and Quake 3 will run smoothly even with a YouTube video playing in the background. <laughs> Though attempting to play an HD copy of Die Hard pushed the P4 and it was clear that it was struggling, as it began to lose frames. Though when the task is something as simple as editing a document or playing a track in iTunes, the 10 year old P4 doesn't miss a beat. To conclude, the Pentium 4 HT is a 10 year old chip that is great for light gaming, music playback, document editing and some light web browsing. But for anything more, you are better to look at getting a Core 2 Duo, Pentium D machine or newer. I would recommend this chip for a home file server or media server but it is by no means power efficient or cool running. If you are looking to build a power efficient media server, you are better to go with an Intel Celeron or Atom. If you like this kind of goofy computer content, do subscribe and enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you, my